so let me talk a little bit about uh, uh, the special. So now, you can see here on the side, maybe, there's, there's a metal ring in here. Well, this metal ring makes the banjo heavier than the, uh, than the, than the, the good time, too. It's, it looks the same, pretty large. You can see it looks, looks almost identical. But this one is a little bit heavier. I, it's about, I think, one and a half pounds heavier. But the toe ring that is patented in this banjo does, it keeps some of the vibrations of the head of moving into the pot. So it actually cuts the bass a little bit and increases the sustain in the mid-range. So this banjo has a lot more translation in a group. So this banjo is a lot more punchy uh, without actually having to work more. Uh, because the free So the banjo is not quite as bassy sounding as the other two, but it has a lot more power to it. In frequencies that are easier to be heard in a jam session, for instance. So if you go, if you play a lot with you know more people or so, you can hear that the sound is, is much stronger. Just a little bit more punch. The special has a resonator, it has a tone ring, and it has in the tone char characteristics. It has a little bit more mid-range and a little bit more punch. It also has a little bit more clarity in the highs. So this instrument is, uh, has also a little bit more sustain in the bass. That means that the notes hold a little longer. And so when you are in a situation, in a jam session with more people, you can, with the same effort, you can hear yourself and the others can hear you much better with this instrument. It's just a little bit louder and punchier.